I'm called Agnes Namuli, working with Metokola Women's Development Association, a local non-government organization working in Rakai district of Uganda, southern Uganda. And we promote water hygiene and sanitation. We focusing on women to have access to water since they have much work. And we also focus on children. Since children have um, have uh, missed school because of looking for water. Uh, right now, we construct water facilities uh, among the technologies we have, uh, shallow wells, water harvesting tanks, uh, ferro cement tanks. Uh, so are you, so it's these technologies like shallow wells and, yeah. and harvesting tanks. Are you uh, teaching people how to use them or are you actually building the systems yourself or how do you work with the, the communities? Yeah, we train the communities in operation and maintenance of these water sources. We identify a community structure which is supposed to educate other community members on how to properly operate and maintain this water source. We educate community monitoring teams. These teams are supposed to promote hygiene and monitor hygiene situations among their respective village mates. We educate children to educate their fellow children in schools. Okay. Um, so, but how long? How long have you been? Uh, working now? We have been working since 2002. Since 2002. Okay, yeah. and have you been monitoring the systems you installed from, from the beginning until 2002? Yeah, we have been monitoring these systems and they are still working uh, because of the good operation and maintenance. Uh, however, some challenges. Can I talk about the challenges? Go ahead, yeah. Uh, one of the Go, major challenges is that these groups which we identify sometimes lag behind just because of what keeps them together. So we had a suggestion of educating these people in entrepreneurship such that they can have income generating activities among which they can have it within their households as well as they properly operate their water and sanitation facilities. Okay, great. Yeah. And so what are you expecting from the Stockholm World Water Week now, uh, in your last, in yeah. two sentences? <laughs> I expect to get more information and share knowledge um, in the World Water Week. And I would like to thank the organizers because this is quite a great exposure where people can learn from others, where we can access knowledge and get to know people who do different activities on water hygiene and sanitation. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much and You're I welcome. wish you uh, the best of luck. Yeah, thank you.